Hey everyone welcome back to the channel. Only 3 days left, then this Thursday, the Champions League event is coming. And on that day, we'll get a gift pack, which will basically contain a Mascherano card, and maybe some extra resources or player items as well, though I'm not completely sure about that. And this time, the Champions League event will most likely be called the League Phase. Anyways, it's basically the UCL event, in simple words. This one is just focused on the group stage, but later we'll see the UCL road to the final and final stages as well. Like we discussed yesterday, there will be a live event running alongside the club challenge in this UCL event. So, just like other events, there will be different chapters in the event, with skill games, matches, and milestone rewards as well. And in the event, you'll mostly need to collect UCL tokens from skill games, matches, and other sources. Then, you can use those tokens to claim rewards. Anyways, these are just our speculations, but of course, the exact details of the event will be revealed this Thursday, as official detailed leaks haven't come out yet. And still, the max OVR will be 103, so maybe in upcoming events, we might see 104 or 105 rated cards, but in the UCL event, the max OVR will be 103. Also, during the UCL event, we will likely receive some special redeem codes and gifts. I'm pretty sure about this, as in previous events, we got redeem codes and gift packages, so this time again, I'm confident we will receive some special items. Well, I don't think there will be any exchanges in this UCL event, but maybe they will introduce new exchanges. Let's see. And this Thursday, November 14th, the UCL event is starting, and next week, on November 21st, the Golden Ball event will also arrive, which will actually be the main event. So, in my opinion, this UCL event will be more of a side event. And in the Golden Ball event, we will definitely see some amazing exchanges for sure. Well, I have already shared every detail about the Golden Ball event with you many times. The Golden Ball event is already live in the Japanese and Korean versions, and the event format is the same in both. So, for the global version, we can expect a similar format, but the OVR of the players may not be as high. We will likely see a max OVR of 105 rated cards. Again, there will be a few milestone rewards, and we can collect points from skill games and matches to earn them. So, I don't think there will be many extra things in the event, but of course, I hope we get some great cards. Also, Tony Cruz might return to the game as he was a Ballon d'Or nominee this season, but I'm not sure though. And here are some cards that we might see in the upcoming UCL and Golden Ball events. So enjoy these concept cards.
So these are some concepts that I've already shown you, and there's a huge chance of them appearing, especially in the Golden Ball event. And recently, as you guys already know, Pepsi-related redeem codes have been introduced. To get these, you'll need to purchase special Pepsi products from the market, and then use the code on the bottle at the redemption page. And these are the rewards you will get, two special kits, a 94-rated sun card, and other resources as well. And soon, they might add Messi to a new redeem code gift package. As Messi is the main ambassador, the possibility is there. And also guys, I think soon they will drop special Pepsi-related codes on their social media so that all users can use them, because purchasing Pepsi and using the code is not possible for everyone. And the rewards will likely be similar, in my opinion. There won't be anything extra special for sure, and we might even just get standard packs like 85 to 99 OVR. Let's see. Well, this Thursday, new Team of the Week cards will be released again. And of course, if any previous cards return, they will get an OVR boost. This time, we are likely to see a 99 rated Vini Jr., and the chances of that happening are quite high. So, if you want that card, definitely save 600 tokens, as I'm pretty sure Vini Jr.'s 99 rated card will be available. If it's a 98 rated card, then 300 tokens will be enough, but it's better to be safe and save 600 tokens just in case. I wanted to get Ferret Skelia's card from Player of the Month, as I think it's the best card available here. Definitely a great card, even his previous cards had top-notch gameplay. I could have easily gotten this card, but, as you can see, I already have many untradeable 100 plus OVR cards, so it's not difficult for me to get this one. But along with them, I'll also need 95 rated Team of the Week cards, which I don't have at all. In fact, I don't have any Team of the Week cards. So this is the main reason guys, I can't get this Beast card, but anyways, I hope you enjoyed this video. See you soon, and that's it for today. Thanks for watching.